is up you guys, I'm Charmix. Today I'm going to be reacting to YTP More Family Food by YT Poop. Now this is a family food, wait not family food, family feud YouTube poop. And I'll always be quite funny. With that being said, the original link's in the description. Make sure you guys go subscribe to YT Poop. And without any further ado, let's begin. Why is the audio so low? <laughs> you can't say that word, Steve. From San Mateo, it's the Electona family. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. It's out of Phoenix, Arizona, it's the Sauce family. Yeah. The Sauce family. Guys, here we go. We've got the top seven answers on the board. Name a Why did they have balloons and the other family not have balloons? Reason Tarzan might cover his private area. Mike. <laughs> <laughs> well, little old Sammy, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What do you do for a living, darling? Um, I'm a full-time sexy student. Okay, where? The jungle. In the jungle. <laughs> Getting some good education out uh, in the jungle. <laughs> 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 Name a reason Tarzan might cover his private area. The quantum mechanic effects of biophysical systems. It's a different kind of family here, would it? <laughs> I hope you're right too, man. I really hope you're right. I do too. <laughs> How are you doing? Pleasure, nice, good, thank Very you. Good. What do you do for a living, sir? I work on the moon. Yay! There you go. Kim <laughs> I work on the moon. That's quite impressive. Why the frig are you on Earth? Name a reason Tarzan might cover his private area. I'm gonna say, uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Hey, let's move on to question two. We <laughs> hey, Jonathan, we talked to 100 single men. What's the best way to blank an old girlfriend? Take her to dinner. Take her to dinner. Dinner. Take her to, to dinner. dinner. Take her. Take her. Take, take her. <laughs> I love the remix. Do Dana. <laughs> I love the remix. Well done. You know, how old are you, man? Uh, 28 years. 27. What's the best <laughs> old girlfriend? Was that guy just guessing the other guy's age or something? Uh, <laughs> Oh, okay, yeah, alright, yeah. What? Welcome back to food, everybody! Boy, we got a good one, two good families bringing the sauce. Fill in the top five answers on the board. Stoots. Stoots! Only one strike. Fill in the top five answers. <laughs> what? <laughs> Name something that might end. I don't know why, but I'm really enjoying this. It's like it's not like the voice mixing isn't like crazy or anything, but it is funny. <laughs> I don't know what makes it so funny either. Like, cause there's glitching, there's not really crazy voice mixing, but I guess the editing that is there is quite, quite funny. But, uh, yeah, I'm liking it, I'm liking it so far. End up in your mouth. Matt. Pot. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kip, let's just get to it, sir. Name something that might end up in your mouth. Uh, how about some <laughs> Some <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna know how that ends up there. <laughs> uh, Welcome back to the food, everybody. The sauce family won the game. And now it's time to play. I'm gonna ask you 20 questions in five seconds. If you can't think of something, 20 questions in five seconds. <laughs> what is that? That's five five questions a second. Wow. Then you just say ass. Then if you and Matt together come up with 200 points, look right there. $20,000! 20, 20 seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. 
We ask 100 men. Tell me the longest you've ever gone without 100 men. A week. Name a food you would order a glass of women with. A steak. Name something you've been tempted to do but didn't. Uh. Women. Name a letter of the alphabet <laughs> that doesn't use very much. Uh. Name a sport men like to watch women play. Uh. The three little pigs. Yay! Come on, man. Hey, so, hey, so. What? What? All right, Mike. Let's take a shot at it, baby. Let's see. We asked one. We asked one. <laughs> Where's one hundred men? Tell me the longest you've ever gone without one hundred men. You said, "Oh God, we say us, say us." Forty-eight points too. Oh my goodness, that's so much. Sauce, sauce. Oh. I said, name a food you would order a glass of women with. You said, steak. Survey said. There you go. You're clapping for one point. It's something you've been tempted to do, but didn't. No, but didn't. <laughs> you said. <laughs> women. <laughs> God, me too. <laughs> Sus. <laughs> no. Oh. Alright, we do. <laughs> what the frick is this edit? <laughs> Doing okay. Name a letter in the alphabet that isn't used very much. You said. Used? Uh, that'd be what? Uh, Z? Not You don't use Z that often at all. Uh. Survey said. Yeah. There we go. Then I said name a sport men like to watch women play. You said. The three little pigs. Survey said. Yeah. 99! I don't think I've ever seen it that high. I think the highest I've seen it, because I, I I like watching the um, Family Feud highlights on YouTube, because they they upload they upload a lot there. But I, the highest I've seen is like fifty something. I don't think I've seen it in ninety nine. Sauce. He has a great spirit because he hangs in there. Mm -hmm. He got 13 points. You need 87. He got 13 points. I guess I can't do math. Because <laughs> uh, from the points that he got, he, it's like 150 something. But I guess it's 13, and I'm just not smart. Nice combination out here. All right, Matt, come on, man. We're going to do this, okay? Come on, partner. Let's go. Listen, I'm going to duplicate the answers so we can give you five seconds. You ready? I'm going to duplicate the answers? What? Ready. Five seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. We asked 100 men. Tell me the longest you've ever gone without 100 men. One day. Name a food you would order a glass of women with. Uh, answer. Name something you've been... <laughs> <laughs> what the frick are they celebrating? He didn't do anything in five... Are they just keeping the answers from the other guy's previous answer? Is that what it, they're doing? I don't know. Let me... <laughs> that made no sense. Anyway, I hope you guys liked this video. I think it was quite funny. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. Like, the, the editing wasn't too crazy or anything like that. The voice mixing wasn't too nuts. But I did enjoy it. I did uh, I did find it quite funny. I think I rate this out of a 10. 6.7. And, uh, yeah, make sure you guys go subscribe to YG Poop. That link's in the description. And uh, with that being said, uh, I'll see you guys next time.